Hello, Jasim. Thanks for taking time talking to the integrator. Jasim, you are at Jitex. You have uh, 20 years at Jitex, I believe. How do you see the change Jitex has brought into the market and how do you see Jitex evolving in the future? Uh, honestly, uh, 20 years went really quickly. Uh, I remember those early days in Jitex where Jitex was uh, a very small exhibition was not having a lot of multinationals. Today you can see Jitex, one of the biggest tech shows uh, in the region and uh, even uh, in the world, where you can see a lot of international brands, a lot of people are always keen to come and exhibit in Jitex. Jitex uh, had proven that it is one of the platforms where a lot of innovation comes to life, comes to birth. Oh, this is really because of the location Jitex in. I think uh, Dubai always proved uh, it is the, the right place of choice. Uh, UAE as well uh, proved that. And that's why you can see Jitex is growing day by day. Jasim, you are the chief ICT officer of Do, and Do is now uh, sub branding itself with Do Tech. Tell me about DoTech and what does Do uh, DoTech's priorities in the market? Uh, Do, as any traditional telco player, they, uh, we always foresee that we need to grow beyond the core. Uh, we started those attempts a few years back, uh, and the time came where we need to sub-brand because uh, you have the right substance, you have the right uh, products, uh, you need to focus on the market in order for you to have a relevant identity to what you offer. Uh, that's why uh, we came with the sub-branding and DoTech uh, was one of the brands that came out uh, that will cover heavily uh, the B2B area. If you look at the product portfolio of uh, DoTech, DoTech is focusing mainly in data center and co-location business, cloud, security, managed services, uh, AI, machine learning, robotics, IoT, uh, as well as digital advisory is one of the areas that we are heavily investing in because uh, we, you always see us, uh, especially in the tech space. Tech space is not uh, an easy place where you can just take a, a direct on-the-shelf product and sell it to your clients. You need to have that engagement of advisory, consultancy in order for your clients to, to trust the solution and because each and every environment differs from the other. Uh, do now, do with do tech, uh, I would say with Jitex, I have to ask you this question, AI. AI is almost everywhere. So what is, how has AI changed the market and what is its impact in the government sector and what is do tech doing to empower this change? See, Every year in the tech industry and technology industry, you will see uh, a buzzword that will shake the industry. A few years back, metaverse, digital twin, was the talk of the town. Uh, this year, it's AI. And for sure, technology will not stop there. If you look at AI, AI is an advanced way of presenting uh, machine learning, things that were there previously uh, within technology, but today with AI and Gen AI specifically, uh, they came on with the steroids, you can call them. So use cases started becoming more. Market is more matured to, to adopt AI use cases. Uh, where do we see AI is going? I was very clear in even my, my, my presentation in Vigen. AI will become a commodity part of any uh, option that you will have in any application and any technology. Today we foresee it as a separate vertical or separate pillar because still the technology is fairly new but eventually moving forward it will be integrated in each and every business flow. So AI will be integrated into each and every business. Now that's how you see AI growing in the market. Of course. Let me ask you uh, what are the key takeaways uh, throughout your tenure maybe key takeaways from the industry right now uh, and what changes would be happening in the future? What and about what is your future plan with DoTech? 
we have a lot of ambitious future plans within Dutech. The moment we have revealed this brand, uh, the ambition from the name itself went so high. Uh, coming from Do, uh, one of the strongest performing telco operators in the region, uh, it puts a lot of pressure on us to take Do Tech to the next level. Uh, being the third strongest brand in UAE uh, by itself put you in a very unique position where you need to thrive uh, introducing the best out of any technology offering that you have. That's why uh, we worked hard to bring the brand to the level of where our clients will really see Dutech as a serious player in the industry. If you see all the work that we have done throughout the last year and a half, two years, in order for us to cement the launch of this brand, uh, we, we signed a Loi partnership with Oracle. This puts us in a, in a unique position by, by claiming that we are a national hyperscaler. Uh, we are building huge data centers when it comes to the amount of megawatt power that we offer because we believe that this is the underlying infrastructure for all the technology advancement. On top of this, we have built a huge team when it comes to digital advisories, robotics, as you can see in our showcases down there. Whatever we are showing is real. It's very easy. You can stack your, uh, your, your showcases with a lot of futuristic or fancy stuff. But for us, we took the route and whatever we will show, it's things that are, can be delivered. Although they are very complex, robotizing a full value chain mm -hmm. when it comes to uh, manufacturing automation or when it comes to storage, it's not an easy task. Today, we offer this as a service and we are proud to do this. Uh, the sky is the limit in new tech. Uh, we are expecting huge growth in the coming couple of years in the tech industry, especially in Dutech. Jasim, you said you are the third strongest brand in the region. I would say we had given the ICT regional award for you being the strongest brand and we very much value how you were, how well of a player you are in the in the entire region. Thank you. Let me ask you uh, the future outlook of the ICT industry as a whole. How do you see that as well? See, technology is booming everywhere. Today, if, if you see any industry, technology is key for its evolution. Agri-tech technology is there. Health technology is there. Education technology is there. Aerospace technology is there. So, but you will grow naturally. The market will push you to grow. The demand from the clients will push you to grow. Uh, your, your, the new generation will push you to grow. The generations that are there now, their demands are totally different than us. For them, smartphone is a commodity. For us, smartphone was a luxury. So you can expect how tough the market will be in terms of demand. And we need to be up to the level of the expectation of our clients. With that, I'm closing the interview. Glad speaking Thank to you, you. Uh, Jasim. And you. down the line, we'll be talking even more. Thank, Thank you. you.